They'll go through the preliminary and analysis. Uh, yeah, accident investigations can take anywhere from from uh, several months to up to a year, just depending on on what the circumstances of this particular incident were. Um, other than that, th there's no real information as far as cause or uh, the incidents that led up to the accident. Um, that will be determined by the board, and when they complete their investigation, that that information uh, will be released. Um, Really, that's where we're at right now. I will tell you, though, that, that it was a training flight. Um, the aircraft, you know, on any given day, we have aircraft flying out within the reservation, uh, just conducting basic aviator tasks. Um, uh, this was a training mission. Uh, the actual events uh, are unknown at this point, um, and that's the purpose of the investigation, to determine the factors that led up to the, the, uh, the accident. The, uh, the debris field, it's daylight now, so we'll start to get a better analysis on exactly uh, how the debris is laid out out there. Um, it has been secured though, so no person can go in and disturb the wreckage uh, to give the safety center the, the opportunity that they need to, to actually find the cause of the accident, anything that may be uh, in the debris field. The, the, the majority is probably located within about a 300 meter uh, area. Of course, like I said, it's very dark. It was very dark out there when we were out there uh, earlier, um, and of course, you know, with with moving aircraft, there there's there could be debris anywhere throughout the woods. It's a wooded area there, so.